Hello, welcome to the beautiful town of Cayucas, right outside of Morro Bay. Today we're gonna go on a little mini nature walk and we're gonna go see a shipwreck and take some pictures in front of it. It's Cash's first time out of the house, so we'll see how he does. He's already been barking at another schnauzer. We've definitely gotta work on that, but it's gonna be fun and come with us. It's also Hazel's first time. It's Hazel's first time mom was pregnant. She was in her tummy. And it's Hazel's first time and Cash's first time. That's right, we came here to take maternity shots when I was pregnant with little Hazel. It's her first time here. They must have had a few rough days at sea. The ocean is destroying it. Arr, there will be pirates in these waters. You've got to watch out. Are you catching? Missy hair don't care, baby. Woo! You can't see, see, but it is to sky. Oh, yeah. One is rainbow, so one is alien. All about aliens, I guess. Everybody likes aliens. Some people don't like aliens. Some people like rainbows. Some people don't. I like a rainbow. So this ship is left over from one of the many storms we get here on the central coast and it's just kind of sitting there. Someone has put up a pirate flag since last time we were here. It hasn't always had that. So it's pretty cool. And now we're gonna head out and have some lunch. Okay, still in Cayucas, we are at Taco Temple. We're gonna go get some tacos for lunch. I got a michelada. Joe got a hazy IPA from Made West. That michelada has the most beautiful presentation of any michelada I've ever had, and it's delicious. I got a nacho. I got taquitos with a side of rice and beans. You know what you got, Willow? She's like, I don't care. Willow got a chicken taco, and I got the sweet potato enchiladas, which come with poblano peppers and cotija cheese and a side of rice and beans. They look so yummy. All right, we're at Main Street Antiques here in Cayuca still. And oh wow, today has been pretty dope. We've had some good Mexican food. Now we're antique shopping. Dude, it doesn't get any better than that. All right, let's do it. Hands up, pockets. Beautiful hand painted sign too. Ooh. Antique Weiss. Oh, that's rad, is that, um... Whoa, that's so cool!
This record player, dude. Oh my god. And that's what we need, don't oh, we? Don't, touch don't touchy. Hands and pocket store, remember? Ooh, that's a sick owl. Look at that rabbit. Did you see that? Oh, that's a oh, decoy. No, dude, I love dogs. But they've gone, like, they blew up, dude, like 10 years ago, and then now they're like crazy. It's not even, I don't even know. They're pretty expensive. Just make your own, I guess. Can you follow me? Yes, that's fine. But you gotta slow down, no running either. This ain't a running store. Dude, Dude, look at the pirate ships. Oh, those are so cool, those bookends. Those are cool too, those brass duck heads. Mama, Winnie Pooh's under here. Oh, Winnie the Pooh's under there. And Piglet. And Piglet too. That's a good Hi find. guys. That's a hazel size rocking horse. Yeah. Whoa, cool big painting of a ship. A little colonial house. Isn't that crazy? That's a cool lamp. What on earth is this thing? Microphone? I don't know. Mom, check out this lamp. Check out this lamp, dude. This is rad. That's rad. That's so cool. Don't touch it. This whole section. Mom, it's one. Free zero. And free zero. How much is that? I don't know. 130, dude. And I think it's worth it. Each one of these handcrafted creations are amazing. It's Look at the detail. Wow. Dada, it's All these reused parts go into cool things. Look at that. Look at the gas can on the bottom all the way up to the top. Little oil can, maybe. Wow. Daddy. Pretty neat. Mama, These are super cool. <laughs> we don't need a stop sign for anything. No, that'd be pretty cool. Stop. Stop right there. Mama. Need a patch of grass, Olive? Oh, yes. Yes. <laughs> I want to touch your grass. Willow, what is that? A horsey bike. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. I want a horsey bike. We can't buy it. Hello. But it looks cool. Yeah. You have an on and off one. That antique store was so cool. They had so much awesome stuff in there, but nothing we couldn't live without. Man, I tell you, antique shopping with three kids is not for the faint of heart. I guess Joe doesn't have an issue with it. Willow tried to touch everything, even though we told him it was a hands and pocket store. But hey, you know what? That's what kids do. So just be careful. If you bring your kids antique shopping, don't let them touch things. Year, you think this tire is from dude. mobile tire, old school, little skinny guy? That's cool. There's a lot of like automotive stuff in the store. Yeah, old school skateboards. You're all about the upstairs, aren't you, kiddo? What is that? I don't know. I think it might be a piece. It's like something spin right here. It's a propeller of some sort. Yeah, I can probably find out in this book right here. But have any of you ever seen a purple insulator? I've never seen a purple one before. I don't think so. We're at Morro Bay Antiques right now, and this place is so cool. They have tons of automotive stuff, and it's in this awesome vintage building. I love it. Oh, what's that? It's that black. Black. I'm sitting in a chair. If you are a decoy duck collector, this is definitely the spot. This is 
is like that. But it's Peppa's house, except it's not. It has stairs. Okay, then let's switch hands. So that building is so cool. I definitely thought it was from the like, what, 1950s, 1960s? Turns out it was built in 1990. Made to look vintage, not actually vintage. It's great. It's a rad building. I like, every time driving, when I used to do drone work up in here back like, you know, seven years ago, man, we do all this crazy. I would always drive by this building and I was, I was like, dude, I love that building. I want to buy it one day. And it's always been an antique mall. And I've come here with my parents a bunch and like, it's always changed. So this time there wasn't as much, but it's always a rad spot. Definitely they are geared more towards like the automotive lover. They have tons of old motor cans. It was super cool. They had a couple beer posters and a, a beaver hardware store sign. So definitely worth a stop. We're about to leave Morro Bay, getting some gas right now, but look, this gas station has a giant dinosaur. Or a mid-sized dinosaur. How cool is that? Old Sinclair gas, it's been around a hundred years. Now we're off to someplace super special. We are gonna go to Adana, my favorite place. And we will have my cake and dinner. My favorite places in the world. We have arrived at the Madonna Inn. We're gonna get some delicious champagne cake and have a little picnic in their secret garden. Unfortunately, we're not staying here today, but it should be a good time nevertheless. This beautiful kitschy hotel is situated in San Luis Obispo and was started by Alex Madonna. And it is themed in the most kooky crazy ways, has amazing wallpaper, amazing carpets, amazing everything. If you've never been here, it's definitely worth a stop if you're on the 101. Maybe it's not on the 101. It's definitely worth a stop if you're on your way through San Luis Obispo. No lions is in here, mom. <laughs> nope, not anymore. Back in the day, you could keep a lion in there, but not these days. You'd never believe it, but the owner of this place used to have a lion that he would keep in that lion's den. Not even joking. Daddy, watch it! Oh, look at it nice! shadow of Mr. Madonna. We're having some champagne cake, a little champagne cake picnic, if you will. We got this cake at the bakery, just a quick little line, and we're gonna enjoy some cake in the nice shade. It's a hot day and slow today. One slice will definitely feed your whole family. <laughs> oh, and can't forget my monster Willis, my monster. Has that calmed the beast? This is their champagne cake. Definitely classic Madonna, decorated in all pink with pink chocolate shavings on it. Super decadent and delicious. Oh, we dropped Ooh. some. Man down. Man down. So good. And now, Mr. Madonna, it's time to say bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye bye. That's the end of this vlog. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.